so first that is the program about the rupee denominations um, there is a, uh, the question is a bank intends to design a program to display the denomination of an amount of up to five digits that is up to five di digits the available denomination with the bank are rupees 2500 150 20 10 5 2 and 1 design a program to accept the amount from the user and display the breakup in descending order of denominations uh, preference would be given to the highest denominations available along with the total number of nodes only one denomination only the denomination used should be displayed so there is the example of 14,788 output denominations like 2000 rupee nodes 7 pieces that means 14,500 into 1, 500, 100 into 2, 200, 15 into 1, 50, 20 into 1, 20, 10 into 10, 10, 5 rupee note or coin maybe 1, 2 rupee coin 1 and 1 rupee coin 1. The total amount will be 14,788 and the total number of notes is 23. So, first check the question clearly what you have to take input check this part design a program to accept the amount from the user it means you have to accept an amount from the user and then check how many uh, rupee denominations available like how many 2000 rupee note how many 500 rupees note how many 100 how many 50 how many 20 how many 10 how many 5 how many 2 how many 1 there is no need requirement like every time every amount denominations is available okay so let's first check a uh, normal example like there is an example and i give another example like so here i take an example of 5788 okay so uh, there is a possibilities of 2000 note it means here is 2000 rupee note 2 that is 4000 and there is a uh, the after delete subtracting 4000 it will be 788 so now how many 500 500 notes here that means 500 that means 1500 okay then remaining amount should be 288 then how many there are two 200 rupee notes it means one so there is 200 remaining 88 so there is no 100 rupee note and there is a possibility of 100 that means 100 remaining 38 now possibilities of 20 rupees into 1 that means 20 remaining 18 and there is a 18 means 10 into 1 equals 18 and then it will be 18 like sorry there's 8 10 rupee means 10 remaining is 8 so there is 8 it means 5 into 1 equals 5 remaining 3 2 into 1 2 1 1 into 1 so that will be the answer so there is a 2 1 1 2 3 1 1 1 1 one and one so two three five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so there are twelve nodes available for this program so that is the answer that is twelve nodes available in that program so so first we have to write as normal import space java dot util dot star next public 
class a need a class name so it like denomination class name can be any name so next call the braces and next create a main function public static void main string args looks like now declare a scanner class system dot in so now this three line for variables purpose so uh, for uh, variable de declaration purpose now first we have to accept a number from user so we have to ask a question to user that is system dot out dot print ln enter the enter an amount and now we have to store the amount in a variable so variable name is like amount amount equals sc dot next int now we have to declare the variable amount so here is int So we just declare a variable amount that is int type. Now we have to calculate the denominations. So we need a uh, 2000 variable, 500 variable, 200 variable, 100 variable, 50 variable, 20 variable, 10 variable, 5, 2, 1. So there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We need 10 integer type variables like a 2000, a 500, a 200, a 100, a 100, a 50, a 20, a 10, a5 a2 a1 okay so now we have to check that the amount given by the user is there possibility of 2000 rupees note or yeah or no so first check our uh, 2000 equals so the variable is amount by thousand this will give you how many uh, 2000 rupees note available in the amount entered by the user and now after counting the number of 2000 rupee notes we have to decrease the number of 2000 rupee notes from the main amount like if we treat that that is 14788 okay then it look like 14 so it look like 14788 by 2000 it means the quotient is 7 and the answer is 7 so it will give us 14000 okay next after removing the 14000 main from the main denomination what will the remaining amount so the new amount equals amount minus a2000 into 2000 or you can write amount equals amount mod 2000 
any one line you can write so i prefer this one okay so that will be the answer will be 788 so now we have to calculate how many 500 rupee note available so that means a 500 equals amount by 500 i think that will be the answer one and amount equals amount mod 500 gives us 288 okay now um, next thing I think that will be 888 is the best to calculate that means 388 okay next we have to check a 2000 a 200 rupee note that means amount by 200 gives you 2 and the remaining amount equals amount by 200 gives you 188 now check a hundred rupee notes that meant amount by 100 it will gives you one and the balance amount after taking 100 rupees note that will be amount mod 100 so that will be 88 now find 50 rupee notes amount by 50 amount equals amount mod 50 it will give you 1 it will give you 38 now a 20 rupee note amount by 20 amount equals amount by mod 20 so a 20 will be 1 and remaining amount will be 80 next a 10 equals amount by 10 so the answer is 1 amount equals amount mod 10 answer will be 8 <coughs> so now 8 means we have 5 rupees 2 rupees and 1 rupee coin okay so a5 equals amount by 5 so updated amount will be amount mod 5 now a2 equals amount by 2 amount equals not two. now a1 equals amount by one so this will give you one this will give you one this will give you uh, one this will give you three and this will give you one So this is the complete program but now that is here this part are variable area this part is a variable acceptance that is the value entered by the user and this part is the calculation calculation accept data that is variable declare 
now we have to print all the output so it likes we have to write system not to print till maximum times so system dot out dot print till 2000 rupees notes a 2000 Uh, next 500 rupees notes plus a 500 system dot out dot print in 200 rupees notes plus a 200 system dot out dot print in 100 rupees notes a 100 system dot out dot print in 50 rupees notes a 50 system dot out dot print in 20 rupees notes a 20 system dot out dot Print in ten rupees notes. It will be a ten. Now three denominations left. That is rupees five, rupees ten. Uh, sorry, five, two, and one. I know my handwriting is not good. Five rupees notes a5 now 2 rupees notes a2 one rupee notes plus a one now that will be the end of main method and that will be the main of main close class close so that is the complete program